Um, now, sat nav. Click the selector forward, turn it till we get to navy. Click the center to select navy. And then you've got destination down here. So that's that brings up the menu by just clicking forward again. So we click down to destination, select destination, turn the rotary selector to address entry, select, you've got town, but we want postcode. That's going across country, town and street. So click back towards you, it's gone to postcode, select postcode, and we are Grosvenor Garage, Chorley Road, Walkneydale, Preston, PR. It's defaulted to numbers now, five, four. It's gone back to letters, so it's a good system. A lot of them don't do that, and you have to keep switching between them. So, Grosvenor Garage, Chorley Road, Walkneydale, Preston, PR5, 4JS. We've typed that in, select. And you've got over here, start, so click select. Is being calculated. Make a U-turn if possible. That's it, that's how you do it. Again, if you click forward, it brings the menu up, and then we can go down to destination, route, destination, destination, easy for me to say, destination, information, alternative route, detour, route list. So we don't want any of those, so we'll click back options, route settings, map orientation, travel guide settings, back again, there you've got, Make a U -turn if possible. that'll repeat the instruction, destination again, the top one is cancel route guidance, so once you've got somewhere where you, you don't need instructions anymore, after your address has been put in already, you then got at the top there cancel route guidance. So if I click cancel route guidance, I click on destination again, continue route guidance or address entry. Hopefully, as I say, that, that will it's quite a complicated system. Hopefully that will have covered everything.